How's it going guys? It's Manny King here. Welcome to your Boys My Choice episode 2. And before we talk about the class setup or even the gameplay, I want to say really quickly, I am not a sniper. I have never claimed to be a sniper. I have said on many occasions that I'm a bad sniper. So this gameplay, if it doesn't come out quite the way that you wanted it to, then I apologize. I tried my best. I played 20 games with this class, uh, just like I will any class in this series. And this was the best one that I got, or semi the best. Uh, there were several games that I got that were pretty good as well, but I decided to pick this one just because it showed a pretty nice streak and I had some pretty lucky shots. But I played 20 games, like I stated, and these this class was definitely a roller coaster ride. I don't know why I said these, but uh, yeah, this class was definitely a roller coaster ride. Um, I think I went negative probably six times out of the 20 games that I played this. It was definitely a learning experience of how to use a sniper effectively because the class it was a little bit weird uh, well at least the secondary was uh, I should probably go into the class setup right now so he wanted me to use the DSR 50 with a ballistic CPU which I guess reduces sway um, the secondary was an RPG that is what I find weird it's drive if you watch this since you're the one that recommended this class to me or requested this class to me uh, why did you want me to use an RPG I always felt that uh, I never really knew where exactly to use an RPG I don't think I ran into a good situation where I needed to use the RPG it just felt like uh, you just wanted me to use a sniper every single time like in close range or long range engagements which that's basically what it made me do and I gotta say it helped me with my sniping a little bit uh, later on in the games I did end up getting a shot I started to develop a better sniper shot so I I guess if that's what you wanted me to do, like develop a better sniper shot and get some practice with just using a sniper, then I thank you for that. But if you just wanted me to use an RPG and try to find good places for me to use it, uh, I couldn't find a single one. And I tried, I think I ended up getting an RPG kill in this gameplay, but I don't know if I get any more than just one. In other gameplays, I did get some where I went like an RPG 360 for like a final kill cam and stuff like that. That's where it came in useful. But besides that, uh, I don't know if I ever used an RPG to really uh, win a firefight. But uh, let me continue on the class setup. So he has me using the DSR, like I mentioned, with the 6 CPU, the RPG, flank jacket, fast hands, dexterity, C4, and tech insert. And he didn't request uh, any specific score streak, so I was using counter UAV, lightning strike, and orbital. So right there, what I just did, I did that a lot. Um, if I noticed that I either got a hit marker or I was going to die to some guy in front of me, I'd rather kill myself and him. So I always threw down the C4 and always just blew myself up. I would do that constantly when I noticed that I might not win this gunfight. And uh, I don't know if that's a good habit to really have, just to kill myself or anything, but uh, right there, I, I have some good shots. I gotta say that I have developed a little bit of a sniper shot, but I'm still not confident to use a sniper, uh, I guess, like a, an ordinary weapon. I still felt the need to switch to a pistol, and right here you're gonna see a sorry excuse for a sniper one-on-one -on -one battle. Right there, I just tried to hip fire and see if I could get them. So that's the only time that I think I really used an RPG, just because I had to reload and I had nothing else I could use. And this was one of those lucky shots that I was talking about why I chose this gameplay. And there's gonna be another one in this round where I'm gonna get a jump shot and hip fire him and actually uh, get the kill. It just surprised me. And actually using a sniper without toughness, it wasn't that difficult. I thought it was going to be a lot more difficult because I thought uh, the way that you wanted me to play, because I could have used this, I guess, class and just sat on top of a roof or in a window and just try to snipe, uh, I guess, the old fashioned way in quotations. Um, I don't know. I could have sniped like how he did there. I could have stayed in a room in a window and just stayed like that and hard scoping. But the way that you had your class set up, I kind of felt that you wanted me to rush around, try my best at quick scoping, which is basically what I wanted to try anyways, try to develop my sniper shot, see if I could get any better with it. And the first round, it's not going to be too good. Uh, the second round is definitely where I go off on a little bit of a streak, but right there, that jump shot and uh, hit fire definitely, I guess, boosted my confidence. I was like, all right, it's sniping time. Let's go. Let's go. So, I don't know. Throughout this whole game, I had, like, this weird up and down roller coaster also because that's just the way I felt with this class. It was like, okay, I'm doing pretty good with it, doing pretty good with it, but then I would run into people that were really good and I couldn't really snipe them to death, <laughs> I guess. But I really appreciate that the DSR doesn't get that many hit markers because I had picked up in the gameplay a uh, ballistic, uh, ballista. I, I don't know why I called it ballistic, but yeah, I picked up a ballista and it just got hit marker after hit marker. So I'm really 
thankful that you picked the DSR. Um, I haven't sniped that much, like I've said before, so I had no idea that the Ballista really got that many hit markers. I've heard from friends that it gets a lot of hit markers, but never knew that it got that many. So right here, this is going to be one of the rare instances where I'm actually going to get an orbital, and uh, it happened probably very few times that I can remember. Uh, where I actually went on a streak where I can get an orbital and I think I end up going on like a 15, 16, 17 kill streak and once I got into the 17 kill streak I'm like what am I doing? How am I doing so good? <laughs> it was basically just I was surprising myself at how well I was performing so right here like this is what I would normally do for people coming around the corner if I saw them on the radar or something I'd usually aim down sight and just wait for them around the corner sometimes I'd get the kill sometimes it would get me killed so I don't know, I'm still trying to develop uh, good sniping instincts, I guess. I'm really not sure if I'm even sniping pretty well this gameplay, but it was uh, really good for me anyways. Uh, as a person that has never used um, a full sniping class, this was definitely interesting. So, like I'm going to remind you guys, every episode you guys can leave new class suggestions in the comment section. Um, I already have episode 3's class ready. But uh, you can always leave in the comment section future class requests, and I can do pretty much anything. Uh, I have access to another class that's ma uh, ma I have access to another account that is Master Prestige. I could not speak, <laughs> but right there, I got overran. I really wish I had a secondary at that point. I was like, I could either use this RPG, which I don't know if I had ammo. I'm pretty sure I did, or I can use my sniper. And as soon as I missed the first shot, I was like, okay, use my knife. <laughs> I didn't even want to use my RPG because I thought if I did, I'd probably kill myself. But I was on a streak. I kind of wanted to keep it going, but ah, eh, oh well. So like I was saying. Uh, episode 3, I already have it ready, but uh, you can still leave class suggestions in the comment section. Uh, you can leave anything. I have access to another uh, account that has Master Prestige, so on Mannequin, I'm probably going to be prestiging pretty soon, so I might not be able to use it on there, but like I said, I have access to another one. So you can leave any sort of class, anything you want me to use, I will use. Episode 3 is going to be pretty interesting. And right here, this is where my sniper shot kind of gets a little bit better. I'm actually quick scoping a lot more. Um, but uh, it's just tough. And right there, I had no idea that was an enemy. Every time I watch this gameplay over again, I'm like, how did I not end up seeing that guy? It, it just really confused me. Do I end up getting another orbital? I don't know if I do. I might. I I don't know, but this gameplay I really don't remember. Even though I got it yesterday, I was running late on some time. I was like, I gotta play these 20 games in a hurry. So I actually got this gameplay yesterday. Uh, I was planning to invite some of you guys into a party while I was sniping so you guys can see how well I was doing. But it was just the fact that I was doing pretty bad at other times that I was like, nope, not gonna bring in anybody. <laughs> so uh, there were games where I went like 21 and 40. Uh, 19 and 35 uh shit what other one there was like a 25 and 44 like i went really negative when i was using this class when i was first getting used to it i did go really negative but then there were games where i finished uh i don't want to spoil the ending score on this one but there were games when i went like this or there was a raid where i went 43 and 15 which really surprised me or there was another game that I went like 46 and 14. So I was getting relatively good kills. But uh, it was just a roller coaster, like I said. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I wasn't able to get like final kill cam, even though I wanted to. Um, but I still won. I won the gameplay. That's what kind of ruined me uh, every other gameplay. I would always try to play the objective as a sniper. And if I'm the best player on the team, then. I'm not going to get anything done, especially using a sniper, but I went 48 and 10. Hope you guys enjoyed. In the description, there's going to be episode links to every single episode that's 